Now you may be wondering why a guy like me who's done a lot of work and restorations on one inch and three quarter inch drive tools would mess around with a little puny three eighths drive ratchet. Now the reason for that is this ratchet is going to get sent to my buddy Cody over at Y-Doc Productions. Now Cody doesn't work on heavy machinery so he doesn't really have the need for a one inch or three quarter inch drive ratchet. Now this is a plumb right field ratchet which means it was made and used around the time of World War II. So this is a very old tool and it matches the tool basically in the same year and era of the one that he sent me just the other day. Now I was planning on doing an unboxing but you can see that uh, the Postal Service didn't do a very good job with this package. Now this was stuffed into the P.O. box of mine and luckily I caught this before it fell out of the open package and onto the floor and it probably would have broke the wooden handle that was on here. But Cody restored this screwdriver, this 1920s screwdriver on his channel and you can see that he actually put my logo in this as well. Now this tool was looking really rough and he made this thing look brand new again and that is absolutely amazing and I can't even express how much that means to me that he would actually send that to me as well. Now he also wrote me this really nice note and he left that in there and I really can't say thanks enough Cody so I wanted to try to send you something in appreciation. Now I want you to use this on your project projects. I don't want you to just put it on a shelf or something like that. I want to see it go to some good use and you know how it is. I could have really spent a lot more time and taken out some of these scratches and nicks but I think it really takes away from the tool of what it is now and what it used to be. But not only am I going to send that to you, I'm going to send you this half-inch drive New Britain ratchet that looks really rough. I got this from a swap meet a while back, but it works well in both directions. So I want to see you do a video on this, taking this apart, cleaning it up, and making it look brand new again, my friend. But thank you very much for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. It truly means a lot. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up leave a comment or a question down below. Consider subscribing if this is the kind of content that you're into. And as always, just a friendly reminder that it doesn't matter if you're working on your project in a garage or in your driveway. What matters is that you go out there, you do the job yourself, and you learn more about your project, whatever that project may be. Now that this video is over, how about you go outside and work on something? My name is Zane, and I'll catch you next time.